Hi guys and welcome. As you can see, I'm back here in the training room again. My favorite place because it's nice and cold. So, I know a lot of people are wondering how classes are going to work again. So I'm just going to go straight into that and then after this section we'll go into how we sanitize everything and keep everything safe for everybody. So from the temperature checkpoint, once you get your temperature checked, the person or the staff that is with you that is taking the temperature will either send you straight to the room that you're going to or the training room. The only time it's different is if your instructor comes out and breaks you guys into different sections or groups and takes you to the other side of the office, but most likely you'll still be in the training room. Once you enter the training room, you're going to see that um, the classes are going to be a lot smaller. As we're practicing social distancing, you'll notice that the seating, again, as you can see here, I'll insert the picture later, you'll see that it's two to a table. Again, classes are going to be much smaller. It's going to be hard to get used to, especially our people that have been coming for a long time that remember how big the classes used to be. So another thing people are asking about is what will happen with CPR. We are still going to teach CPR. Um, the only thing is that you will be learning compression-only CPR. We will still teach you how to adjust the head to give breaths, but we will not be forcing people to give breaths. Um, just because of everything that's going on, we don't want to risk anything with anyone getting sick or anything. Um, but remember that compressions are the most important part of CPR, so you'll still be able to retain CPR and learn it. Just we will not be giving breaths. 